What's going on guys? Malik. Welcome to the Coach Malik Show. My name is Malik Manoon and I am going to be your virtual coach. I'm going to give you the knowledge, the tips, and the advice to help you perform better in all aspects of your life. From the top. What's going on, guys? Welcome to another episode of The Coach Malik Show. This is the voiceover portion of my workout where I talk over my workout about a fitness topic. And today it's going to be weights versus cardio. Which should you do and which is better? Now, this question pops up all the time and it's uh, very common in the fitness space and especially with weight loss, fat loss. Should I do weights or should I do cardio? And I hear most people say I should do cardio. Let me lose the fat. And then I'll build up to weight and I'll build up to build my muscles later. Well, let me tell you, this is what my, I got little notes here. Um, so a cardio workout does, these are the pros and cons of each. You know, a cardio workout does burn more calories. Your heart rate is higher um, probably, in a, you know, for a short amount or for a longer amount of time instead of short burst as, a, as you are weight training. Um, however, when you do weight training, your metabolism will probably be more elevated after your workout. So you'll be burning more calories because your body is, you know, breaking, it broke down the, you know, muscles during the workout. And so now it has to repair them, has to burn calories to, you know, bring fluids there and bring nutrients there to repair the muscles that you broke. So your metabolism in general will be higher or more elevated um, post-workout than, you know, a cardio workout. Um, so hence, this is the final, you know, what do you say? Final, final input is that the most optimal exercise program, all right, the most effective exercise program would include for body composition, would include both cardio and weight training, all right? Now, there's different types of cardio and different types of weight training. I'm not saying you gotta do specific um, types of weight training or specific types of cardio. But both are needed, and here's why. When you do just cardio, you're not building the muscle, you're not building your bone density, and so as you grow, uh, as you get older, you're gonna be more brittle, you're going to maybe get injured more often, you're going to be more susceptible to you know, a tear or a, and this isn't for everybody, you know, I'm saying you, know, you obviously have your outliers, I'm just saying with the general population, that's what usually happens, is that when you're a you know, cardio junkie, no weights, you know, not even like, plyometrics or you know body weight training which i still think is great form of you know resistance training or weight training right uh but when you do none of it then your body is going to eventually over time uh you know atrophy lose muscle mass um and be more susceptible to gain body fat so that's a con to doing just cardio and a con to doing just weight training you know, if you're only doing weights and you're not pushing your heart, you're not exercising your heart, you're going to be more susceptible to, you know, high cholesterol, high blood pressure, um, high, you know, heart rate, uh, resting heart rate. So those are other things. Those are other cons to just doing weight training. So both of them are good, you know, because one leads to, um, you know, injuries and pain and then in more of an external, right? And then one leads to a, a pain on the internal, you know, your heart, your blood pressure, uh, and both aren't good for longevity. So that's why the most optimal, the most effective exercise program would include both the cardio portion and the weight training portion. And it could be 30 minutes here, 30 minutes there. Like it could be 30 minutes cardio, 30 minutes weights. It doesn't have to be an hour for both. Pick your amount, pick your amount for the week and be consistent with it. That's the main thing that matters is consistency. So that's my opinion. Um, you know, after coaching and uh, being a trainer for six years in the fitness industry, working out for, you know, 12 years now. Um, that's what I've come to conclusion is that both are best for effective programming. Hope that helped. 
If it did, put a like down in the bottom below. Leave a comment of what you like the most in this portion of Malik's Fit Tips. Enjoy the rest of this video. We are willing to extend it today or tomorrow um, if that's something that you wanted to do. All right, left voicemail and B, let's go. Uh, follow up in a week. Now, let's get ready for the calls. We got 20 calls in 20 minutes. It's not gonna take me 20 minutes. It's gonna be a little longer than that, but it's all right. December 2nd call log. You ready to see this in action? I don't know if you're ready for the boom. Ladies and gentlemen, I wanna welcome you all out to a musical extravaganza called the Night and Night Project. Crystal! I'm in the AC cooler than I ever was. Oh, Crystal, come on. Press one for more options. Hey Crystal, this is Malik. I'm calling from Orange Theory Fitness here in Strawberry Village. Just wanted to give you a quick follow-up call and see if you're still interested in some membership. Um, I remember calling you a little bit last week and uh, leaving you a voicemail about our holiday specials. We'd like to extend that for you. Uh, it ended on the 30th, but we are ex we can extend it until uh, a couple more days here. So let me know if you're interested. Uh, give us a call back, 415-433-1200. Hope this message finds you well. Again, my name is Malik, and hope you're having a wonderful day. Talk soon. Bye. Let's see what let's see what you got here. The little OTF action. Hello. Oh. Thanks. Thought I was gonna answer this one. Round two. Alia! Alright, Alia, come on, man. Come on. Hello? Hello, Alia? Hello, this is Malik yeah. with Orange Theory Fitness. Yeah? Uh, is Hi. This, do you have a minute? Is this a good time? No. No, yeah, it's. No, it's I, it, got, I got your call. Yeah, I'm. I'm good. I'll call you guys when I, I'm already working out. Okay. All good. Okay, bye. Bye-bye. Well, got a conversation there. You know, got someone off the list that we don't have to waste time. Not our time, their time as well. We don't have to waste their time calling them because they're not interested. From the top. Kathy, let's go. Okay, okay, okay. Drop that. Kathy, thanks for calling. Ignore. Ignored. At the tone, please record your message. Hey Kathy, how's it going? This is Malik Kong with Orange Theory Fitness here in Strawberry Village. I'm actually going to redo this one because... If you're satisfied with the message... So if you guys didn't know, if you guys are doing voicemails, you can actually, if you press the pound button, if this thing even focuses... Anyway, if you guys use the pound button, you guys can redo it. Is your message erased? At the tone, please re-record your message. Hey, Kathy, this is Malik. Mirage. Uh, Everyone ignore me today? At the tone, please record your message. When you finish, please yeah, yeah. hang up or press 1 for more options. Hey, Raj, how's it going? This is Malik. All right, left of another voicemail. Oof. Well, there it goes, guys. There it goes. Say what's up to the vlog. Oh, no. I don't know. I'll post it. Yeah. You kidding me? It's my life, though. Thanks, T. I probably won't post it. There's so much stuff I found when don't post. Well, make it entertaining. Come on now. You know I'm in here drinking my bang. Make it entertaining for the films, for the viewers. Another missed call. Alright. Alright, let's just keep rolling. Just keep coming. Last one. Last one. Alright. Cassin. What we got here? What we got? Hi, this is Kat 
Hey Cassin, how's it going? This is Malik. It's alright. You know, not very productive uh, day, I would say. Um, but you know, in sales, you just gotta reach out, you gotta follow up. So I'm gonna follow up with her in a week. And, uh, you know, you just gotta keep. It's the name of the game, you know. I'll actually film a little bit of this later because I wanna see how I do on my follow up, on my personal follow up. It is 3.41 and I am about to head out of the office, so. Oh, let me answer the freaking phone. Let me do my job. What's going on guys? Just got off work here at Orange Theory. Uh, and I just want to go over the best snack for bulking. This isn't the best snack actually, but it's pretty good. Basically what I always say when you're bulking, you know, you obviously want to eat as clean as possible, right? But what you also want to do is make sure that you get snacks or get foods that are calorie dense. So about nine of these things, let me see real quick. They're really small. See, look, super small. About nine of those are 150 calories and you can munch these down, you know, 18, 36, easy. So make sure that when you're bulking, you're getting snacks that are high calorie dense, right? They have protein in them, they have carbs, and they have fats. Because these are the pretzel peanut butter ones. Ooh, you haven't tried these ones out yet. Try these out. But pretty much that's what I recommend. Obviously, you know, there's other options, such as snacks, such as, you know, mashed potatoes or um, ground beef or you know, but I'm just talking about snacks, simple snacks you can get at a store, simple snacks you can get at, you know, I'm sure you can get this at any of your grocery stores, little peanut butter filled pretzels. Um, another snack I really like as well, which is pretty high calorie dense for what it is, is bananas and peanut butter. Is you just, you know, two, three bananas, eat peanut butter with it, it increases the amount of calories in just eating the banana, and also uh, adds protein to that as well, and fat, all right? Peanut butter is great. If you're bulking and peanut butter is not in your diet, Get it in your diet, it's gonna help you bulk. Um, Cause it's bulking season, baby. It's bulking season. It's starting to rain here a little bit here in California. It's starting to get a little rainy season. So anyway, little short clip on snacks for bulking. Hope that helped. If it did, like this video, put it down in the comments down below, and I'll see you next clip. From the top. Okay, okay, okay. Drop that. Yeah. From Alpha to Omega, VHS to Beta, PlayStation to Sega, my skill is still greater. The sickest thing since BD, wicked like BG, with my life crooked like the Alright guys, so that wasn't too much, just me cold calling a little bit here at work at Orange Theory. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do next, but just wanted to film that a little bit. One, to get it on film, and two, for any of you guys who are doing sales, who are doing follow-ups, just show you guys uh, what I do at least on my end. So, hope to help some of you guys in the sales space and sales industry. Uh, I know I've learned a lot in my sales uh, career in the last three or four years. People don't understand that being a personal trainer, you're also in sales because you got to sell yourself, got to sell your services, you got to sell your, your product. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys want anything, if you guys like this, put it in the comments down below. If you did enjoy, let me know what you enjoyed the most out of this. I'm really curious. I'm really trying to do these vlogs more, I'm really trying to film more content for you guys. So please, if you did enjoy this, put it down in the comments so I'm able to kind of recreate more of the stuff that you enjoy. So thanks for watching, appreciate you, and I'll see you next time. Pray for him, make him meet the devil. I play the villain, man, you can play the good fella. Nice guys finish last, you ain't even passed the class. Matter of fact, you ain't even study for it. Rapping just your hobby, man, you trying to get some money for it? Yeah, I'm just setting the standard. They can't do what I do, man, and you can't stand it. Bring the high.